And new this morning, the city of Pittsburgh is laying out their plan on how to fix a plow problem that plagued multiple neighborhoods last year. Brianna Smith joining us live in Brookline, one of the hardest hit neighborhoods last year that experienced difficulties due to the response time. So Brianna, what can you tell us? Well, Lindsay and David, yes, I remember being in this neighborhood last season, talking to frustrated residents about their snow covered streets and the amount of time it took crews to clear them. But city leaders hope that this season they'll improve the service. Now, Mayor Ed Ganey and Public Works Director Chris Hornstein revealed their goals for this season. They hope to have the city roads cleared within 24 hours of snowfall. Once the department enhances its equipment and staffing, they want to see the time drop to 10 hours. Hornstein said, as they'll lease 15 more vehicles to help with their aging fleet. And Ganey's proposed budget includes 40 new workers and 15 new drivers. Now, here's what Hornstein had to say about the plowing process. Sometimes we don't plow at all. So we only plow whenever there's three inches or more snow on the street. That's the industry standard. Um, but whether we're, we're plowing or whether we're salting, um, you know, we always start with our emergency routes, then we go into our primary streets, secondary, and tertiaries. Some of those same crews that are responsible for snow removal are also responsible for assisting our first responders in the case of an emergency. So when there's a um, car stuck in a snowdrift, um, somebody's having an emergency situation at their home, um, an ambulance needs help getting around city streets, we have to respond to those people. When that happens, um, you know, that takes our folks out of, out of, line to help them, which means it takes a little bit longer time for, for them to get to your street. And city leaders are also trying to avoid snow removal delays in neighborhoods like Brookline, Carrick and Overbrook by building a new public works facility. The project will be delayed another year, but they hope to have it ready for next winter. Now, in the meantime, city leaders are encouraged drivers to stay off the road during snowfall. And if you have to go out, use the routes that are plowed. Reporting live this morning, Brianna Smith, KDKA News.